I love the diversity of San Francisco. It's surrounded by the ocean and the bay, so we have moody weather here. It's amazing to just sit and watch the fog roll in. The fog has a really mysterious air. You can see it cover up the whole of the bay, encapsulate the city. The Golden Gate Bridge is iconic San Francisco, and every time you drive over that bridge, it's an amazing experience. On my paternal side, my grandfather was born in Louisiana, so he was a Cajun, and my grandmother was an amazing baker. And then on my Mexican side, both of my grandparents cooked, so I was always surrounded by food my entire life. Jardinier tends to be a special occasion restaurant, and it's such a pleasure to know that you were part of really special moments in people's lives. This dish is a warm bread and baby artichoke salad with a marinated crescenza, which is a cow's milk cheese that comes from one of our local producers. When you saute the baby artichokes, they get this toasty, nutty flavor to them, and that fried along with the bits of bread makes this, this great texture in the salad. It's not a showy, modernist type dish, but it's gonna be very satisfying every time that you have it. We have amazing farmer's markets here in the Bay Area. Ferry Plaza is an amazing place to shop. As a chef, it definitely provides a lot of inspiration for what you want to cook. There's all kinds of different ethnic foods here. Food trucks have become a big thing. Off the Grid organizes a bunch of these different food trucks. You can go and try lots of different types of cuisine. San Francisco is built on a number of hills. You can see all these steep vistas and the architecture obviously is built in the Victorian era. It's seven miles by seven miles and the population is 850,000 people. So it's small, but it's also just stunning. I always appreciate, no matter where I've been, that I live in one of the greatest cities in the world.